Hello friends, it's Shara. Thanks for stopping by. I am here with sweet Logan and I just can't fake it anymore. It is not fall in San Diego. <laughs> I mean, it's gonna be up in the 80s this week. So <sighs> I have got to get him out of these clothes. I still will dress him in fall colors and maybe some thick porridge socks, as I've heard other channels call them. I've been waiting for Zara to get their socks back in. They're so huge. I, I mean, I don't even know. But I am going to put this really cute t-shirt from Zara. It's got mountains and a little house or, a, you know, a little cabin. It's got trees and a lake very cute so i'm gonna put that on him i'm gonna put <laughs> same color he's wearing one of the um buttas he gets a butta so i'm gonna take him out of this i may leave the hat on i don't know we'll leave it on for now but it is just too hot for all this yep so I appreciate all your comments yesterday. It's hard to stay happy all the time, you know, and I try to be a cheerful person, but I have been sad quite a bit. And I know my daughter misses me and the family, her brothers. Um, you know, she has a lot of family here that hasn't met her um two youngest children and um haven't seen andrew since he was you know i mean they haven't seen everyone for two and a half years she was here in in april of 2018 yeah no 2019 and so that was two and a half years ago and um so you know and, and and no one um, but me has met her first daughter, Catalina, uh, her, her mother-in-law, but I'm talking from my side of the family. Um, and, uh, and he has sisters there um, and family and lots of, they have lots of cousins, but I'm speaking mostly of my, my side of the family. Um, he has a really cute diaper on, but I'm going to change it. Um, so, um, and then I haven't even met Malia, as you all know. She's two months old already. She's growing so fast. We're going to take this one off, okay, Logan? I love this diaper. It's a barn and all kinds of farm animals and it has the name next to all the animals or it says it actually says what they say like moo and cluck and nay I love it very cute oh thought I stuck it down so it's a very cute diaper and this is from imagine baby one of my favorites so cute. I love the kind of a yellowy green inside. And uh, it's from the Mountain Baby on, um, you can get them on uh, Amazon. So this one's really cute. Love it. Love it. Do you love it? Do you love it? <laughs> You're just looking at me, Logan. What's up with that? You're staring at me. You're like mom. Quit talking to nobody. You're not even looking at me and you're talking. Who are you talking to? Well, I'm talking to all your aunties and uncles. Yeah, I am. All your aunties and uncles out there who are my friends and they love us and I love them and I think you love them too. I do, you've never told me, but you're kind of quiet about that. This boy is heavy. I think he has glass beads all the way up or 
I don't know. He is so heavy. His legs are like super heavy. <laughs> super heavy. And then his sister is so light. They're the same sculpt, but um, Daisy is really light um, the way she was weighted. They're different artists um, that created them. So it does make a difference. That's one thing I think that all collectors need to be able to do. And, and I heard this in the beginning and I was like, no, I'll never be able to take a baby apart. And uh, it really is because no one can, you know, weight a baby perfectly for you every single time. Um, you know, it's an individual thing and some artists like them fuller, some like them um, lighter, some like their heads floppy, some like their heads to flop forward, some like them to flop backwards. Um, Sitting at babies need to be weighted. Oh, uh, babies that sit up need to be weighted without a weight in their head. Um, it needs to be at their neck, at the base of their neck, so that their heads don't, you know, flop and then flop them over. I think I want to keep his undershirt on, but I think I'm going to keep it folded so you can see his diaper. They look cute. That's what I think I'm going to do, Mr. Logan. Yep. That's what I think I'm going to do. Okay, let's get this shirt on. It's very cute. It's got wood buttons. Oh, it's got a string. Oh, I think that's attached. Oh, I'm going to have to cut that one. It's attached to the button. Don't want to be pulling that. I've had that happen before, and... I'm not as capable of sewing on a button as I used to be. <laughs> nope, I'm not. My eyes can't see to thread it. And uh, my hands don't work so good pinching that tiny needle. No, not really. I mean, I could do it if it was on something that wouldn't show, but I wouldn't do it on something that's visible. Huh, the shirt feels like you may need their bigger size, but maybe it's just while I'm getting it on. It's so nice and stretchy. Oh, look at that. It is stretchy, but you're a big boy. Let's sit you up. Oh, you're heavy too. I think you're just heavy laying on it. <laughs> Can't pull it down. Oh, there we go. It wasn't too small. It wasn't too small. I just couldn't move it because you were laying on it. Yeah, I am going to take his hat off. It's too hot. It's too hot for the hat. Too, too hot. Let's get your legs straight so that mama can get the socks on. I just want to see how they look. I'm not going to leave the socks on. I'm going to leave him foot loose and fancy free. Oh, I'm going to cut that. I'll do that and then I'll button it. Oh, what is this? Look at this. Wow. I guess I'll be cutting that too. <laughs> it's a long tag. <laughs> Poor real babies. If people don't cut them off, I mean, oh, that would drive me crazy. You know how tags tickle. And that one's right by your side. Oh, this is so cute. Gosh, this is so soft. You can't even tell that the onesie's folded. I like that it's showing his butter. Uh, oh, I hate this tag. I love that it's showing your butter. Let's see your, let's see your butt in the butter. Let's see your butt in the butter. I think it's funny that I have to say it butter. <laughs> I don't know how else to say it. Butter. Uh, it always just sounds funny. Well, that's a little bit bumpy, but I can fix that later. But there's his booty in the butter. It's a little crooked. Oh, I think I might need to loosen it. 
Oh, no, there we go. I just had it crooked. Are you smothering over here? No, you're all right. You're all right. There you go. Oh, look how cute. Look at how cute. I like it when his legs can go like this. And he can really look like a little baby. So cute. It's a little bit bunchy right there, but when I say it's really back over. I think once I button it and maybe flatten that um, onesie underneath a little bit. All right, so let's try these porridge socks just because mommy has seen them on other channels and I love them. I love Shelby, love her style and I that's where I got the idea of the buddhas and then when they were on sale and then she has these socks and I just love them she put them on a teeny tiny little pearl um, skull which pearls pretty little so oh my gosh they are cute you could wear those with this outfit good just cuz Babies should have their feet covered if it's not like really hot. I don't know, maybe she had a different size. I only saw one size. They didn't have them available for the longest time. No, well, they didn't, but they're cute. I wonder what they'll do if I wash them. Yeah, they're hard on a, on a textured um, varnished baby because they kind of just slide off because they're not tight enough. So I'll wash them and see how they do. I'll wash them. Well, that was quick. You look so cute in your butter. And I love this little shirt. It is so sweet. And you look so much more comfortable, Logan. Yes, you do. You look so much more comfortable. I think I'm gonna adjust your diaper. It's too tight. This and put it just on the second one because he's a big boy. You got big legs, and I tend to overdo it on these diapers. Pull them too tight. There you go. There you go. You're a big boy, huh? That's better. That's better. Cutie patootie. All right, guys. Well, thanks for stopping by and seeing our gorgeous Logan here get changed into his really cute t-shirt to be much more comfortable. Huh? Much more comfortable. For those who don't know, um, Logan is the Greta sculpt by Andrea Arcello. And he was painted by Off the Hook Designs. He has beautifully painted hair. And his sister Daisy will be getting a change as well. She has some booties and thick tights and a sweater on. She's roasting over there, but she is also the Greta Sculpt, and she was done by um, Sylvia Creations. She's one of the prototypes. She's very beautiful. And it's so crazy how they look so similar in coloring, even though they were done by different artists at different times, but they totally look like brother and sister. Not just because of the same sculpt. They look like you know their skin tone and everything all right guys well thanks so much for stopping by i hope you guys have a wonderful rest of your day and i may see you tomorrow for theme thursday i haven't yet decided i don't know if i have the energy <laughs> i'm still recovering from you know changing 20 babies into their fall outfits a couple weeks ago 
All right, as always, friends, we are sending you wishes of love and light, and we'll see you in the next video. Bye, friends.